Hey guys, it's Jill, and today is going to be a get ready with me, and we are going out on the town. It is girls' night, so of course I need to start with a mask and get my face looking good. Um, this is the Bombshell Bath Time Dead Sea Mud Mask, and then that that I'm holding up is the um, Vitamin C Serum. It's a super antioxidant, anti-aging, and it brightens skin tone. Um, now the mask, what it does is it's a unique blend of dead sea mud and other natural ingredients. It cleanses, detoxes, and revitalizes skin. It's known as the fountain of youth. Mud from the dead sea has many beautifying and therapeutic powers. Um, the mineral rich formula absorbs excess oil, removes dirt and toxins to reveal fresh, soft skin, simulate circulation, and can improve the appearance of skin's texture, clarity, and tune and you just leave it on <laughs> you just leave it on your face for 15 to 20 minutes once it dries it's going to look like this it's going to be kind of tight and you just get a um warm washcloth and just um kind of rinse it or not rinse it off but wipe it off um now the vitamin c serum it is basically going to um help to like i said it's an anti anti-aging it brightens your skin tone um, what does it say? It says do not. Okay, use within 60 days of opening. Um, so you have to use this within 60 days. Um, and I love this stuff. It's great. It's moisturizing. It's not too moisturizing. So it's great to go underneath your foundation and it just kind of gives a nice glow. Um, the mask made my face super soft and beautiful and I'm super happy with both of them. Um, and if you want these products, I will leave a link down below. And when you sign up and put your email in, you will get 10 percent off. So definitely recommend them. They are great and I really like them. Uh, now we're just going to get into the makeup. I will link everything down below that I used. Um, I'm just priming my eye with the Kat Von D uh, Locket Concealer um, and I'm taking, I'm going to use like all the brushes. Or I'm going to put all the brushes down there too. Um, I just took the Revealed Smoky Palette from I believe that's BH Cosmetics and I'm just putting that white powder um, that right there is Max uh, Soft Brown, and I'm just using that as a transition. And then I'm going to go over that with Makeup Geek's Cocoa Bear. And I just really love the combination of these two. They just made the perfect little um, transition, transition shade. Going back to that Revealed palette, I'm taking that black. And I'm just taking it into the outer corner of my eye, just like so. Oh, yeah, there's my sob. There's my skin. <laughs> really, Jill, there was me like, oh, ah, my skin's so soft. Because it really is. Now I'm going in between these two silvers or grays. Um... I really should have just used one of them. I don't know why. I usually use that one right there. Um, but I went in between both of them. And now I'm just patting them on my eyelid. I used a Real Techniques shader brush, which I have really been loving lately. Oh, there's me singing. I was listening to Shawn Mendes. Um, this. Oh, my gosh. This, this, this. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> uh, the Stila glitters, they are just amazing. I think this is like Diamond Dust, the color. This is seriously my go-to night out look. I have gotten so, so, so many compliments whenever I wear this glitter on a night out. Um, it looks so good in the dark, you guys, like in the club. Um, or if you're going to dinner where it's going to be dim, this looks amazing. So this is a really, really, really great nighttime eye look. Um, like I said, I get compliments on it all the time. As a matter of fact, I did my friend's makeup. Oh, girl, you are just dancing and singing away. Um, I did my friend's makeup for a bikini competition, and uh, it looked amazing on stage, too. Um, so those are my favorite um, lashes from the drugstore at the moment. They're the Ardell Wispies, and they're amazing. Um, this is the Becca primer. I can't remember the name of it. Again, I'll link it down below. This one I use as an, for a night out because it does add a little bit more of a glow than the normal Becca primer that I use. Um, this was the HD Forever Makeup Stick and then the Revlon 
um, foundation, which I don't like. It's like the photo ready foundation. And it's, I only wear it because I'm super tan right now. And it's the only thing that matches my skin. I mess or I mix it with the foundation stick because it's like glitter city. And I just am not, no, I mean, for a night out, I guess it's not bad, but I don't know. I just, I really don't like that foundation. <laughs> but like I said, it's the only foundation I have in my shade right now. So I just kind of mix the two to kind of, um, uh, go like get so the glitter wouldn't be so intense. It kind of knocks down the glitter effect from that uh, Revlon foundation. Um, now I'm just taking my uh, Urban Decay um, Weightless Concealer, which is my all-time favorite concealer. And I'm just taking my Real Techniques sponge to blend all of that in. Now I am taking my NYX contour palette. I love this. I'm taking that banana powder and I'm just taking that underneath um, my eyes. Oh, I didn't even show it. I basically set my eyes. Um, but here I'm taking Cocoa Bear and MAC Soft Brown again. And I'm just taking that underneath the lash line and just kind of blending that out. I'm just taking some mascara on the top and the bottom. I do not like this It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara anymore. It is just... It's too, like, messy and just gross and all over the place. Oh, no. I can't think of the word. It's not clumpy, but it's something. But um, anyways, I just took that um, contour shade from the NYX palette, and I'm just going around my face contouring, adding a little bit of sculpting to my face. <laughs> This is the Laura Geller um, Brighton, Brighton and Bake found, no, uh, blush in Tropical Hues. I love this color. It looks amazing um, whenever I have um, a tan. So um, I'm just spraying my brush with some Scandinavia finishing spray. And I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighting palette, which I absolutely love. And I went in between the two like bronzy gold shades and I'm just making myself super highlighted. And then this one, oh my gosh, like what, Jill? <laughs> this is some amazing stuff. I obviously need to go get a new one because it is so good. I didn't realize. I, I was like, I thought I had more. So girl, I was digging that stuff out. I was like, come out on my brush onto my face. Come on. You know you want to. Um, then, of course, it just set my face. This is the nude stick. Um lip and cheek uh, lipstick in the color Whisper. And then I just outlined my lips with the ColourPop um, lippy pencil in uh, Chai. Everything will be linked down below. Don't forget if you want to get the mask and the vitamin C serum, that, um, that link will be down below as well. And you can click the link and it will get you 10% off when you enter your email okay so this shirt you guys taking it out for a night on the town I'm so excited this shirt right here I featured in my Shein haul and I absolutely loved it I talked about the scent got it out with the laundry enhancer if you guys want the laundry enhancer I will link it down below I'm so excited for this. So, um, yeah, I had the black shirt on. Jewelry, I have these earrings from Marshalls that I wear all the time, you guys. I wear them in the shower, I wear them in the pool. Like, they are just holding up, like, beautifully. And they were, like, 20 bucks. I'm like, yes. So, this jewelry right here, this necklace, is absolutely beautiful. It's from this company called Ana Luisa. And I have a giveaway coming up on some gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous earrings from this company. Um, I've been testing out this necklace and I absolutely love it. They sent me this one and then a gold one, which I am just absolutely obsessed with. So really dainty and pretty. I don't think that you want anything too overpowering for this top because this top literally speaks for itself, doesn't it? Like, it's just perfect. It's the perfect little peplum. If you guys want more of a defined waist, 
and kind of like more of an hourglass shape, this is a shirt that's going to give you that. Um, this bracelet is just really pretty. I honestly don't know where I got it from. Is that bad? Um, but I'm wearing it, so it's really pretty. Um, it's just kind of as a cuff, and then it's got this little chain, which is pretty. And that's the detail of it. My nails are just um, the SNS powder. For pants, I am wearing these wax jeans that I got from Rainbow. These jeans are phenomenal. If you are a curvy girl and you are like, you know, have like a bigger bottom half, these are just perfect. These are size 20. Um, they're definitely super, super, super stretchy, so they're that material that will get looser throughout the day, and then you have to start, like, ugh, pulling it up and stuff. But now I love the way that they look because they're really tight, and they have a little bit of distressing. And then these shoes I actually got from a consignment shop in my town, and they're from Vince Camuto, and if I can find them, I will link them. They are... Super comfy to walk in. You guys, I have graduated to a full on wedge. Are you guys proud of me? If you've never watched me before, I'm on a weight loss journey and I have not been able to wear wedges um, for a really long time. So they're super, super, super comfy. They're like so easy to walk in. They're easy to dance in. Um, but yeah, they're super, super, super cute. And I really like this outfit. So I'm super excited to go out of the town with my girls. Do you know what? I'm gonna act like tonight, the world is my runway. And I'm just gonna walk just like this. What y'all think? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I am totally feeling myself though. I love my makeup. I love this outfit. This outfit I'm totally feeling, so I am really excited. And this tan, can we talk about this tan? Yes. Yes, you guys, I wear sunscreen. So you can tan with wearing sunscreen. I wear like a 60. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments down below if you like this style of video, if you want me to change them up. I will definitely start doing more outfit of the day videos. Do you like <clears throat> outfit of the days better? Do you like outfit of the weeks better? Let me know that in the comments below. If you guys have not subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Join the Jill party. And yeah, don't forget to click the notification bell as well so you're always notified of every upload. Um, I definitely try to upload three times a week. And yeah, uh, that will do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much. Uh, everything will be linked down below. Have an awesome day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.